Recently, one of the toughest trotters in the biz retired. His name is Vivid Photo, which is really appropriate considering he had his picture taken after a whole lot of races. The son of SJ's photo was a $30,000 purchase in the fall of 2003. Owned by Todd Shadle and Roger Hammer, the two-year-old made just under $20,000 in six starts, and he was hardly a household name in the biz. But when he turned three, all that changed. As a sophomore, he started showing up consistently in the winner's circle in Pennsylvania Sire Stakes. Up next, his first ever race at the Meadowlands in the Hambletonian Elimination, when he won in 153-2 by a neck. It was Roger Hammer's first win at the Meadowlands in 11 years. And the next week, it was on to the ultimate test of greatness, the $1.5 million Hambletonian final. In that jewel of the trotting triple crown, Vivid Photo, with trainer driver Roger Hammer at the controls, took back and then late in the mile, he exploded past his competitors to pick up the victory in 152 and three. His efforts that year earned him the 2005 United States three-year-old Colt Trotter of the year. And since he was a gelding, and obviously no stud duty was in his future, he continued to race and won another award in 2007, when he was named the United States Older Male Trotter of the Year. Vivid Photo went behind the starting gate in his career 178 times, with 49 wins, 30 seconds, 20 thirds. He took a lifetime mark of 150 and two. And as a matter of fact, he won in sub 151 miles twice. His lifetime earnings total over 3.2 million. The now 10-year-old trotter was honored this summer at Pocono Downs with a special retirement ceremony. Vivid Photo came to the winner's circle for the last time. He was even wearing his Hambletonian saddle pad. There he was met with applause, a plaque, and numerous bouquets of carrots by his connections and fans. His adoring public wore We Love Vivid Photo buttons, cheered as his saddle pad was removed and a cooler with the words, best wishes Vivid Photo on your well-deserved retirement was put on his back. Vivid Photo has a fantastic website where you can relive some of his greatest performances. Check it out at vividphoto.tv. There are links to winning stakes events, lots of information, and pictures galore. Or should I say, vivid photos, to honor this outstanding iron horse. Vivid Photo's most famous victory came in the $1.5 million Hambletonian. It was a surprise drive from Roger Hammer in the greatest trotting stakes race in the sport. And they're off and trotting off stride, Mr. Dream OM. And gunning out is self-professed, looking to show early speed there. Strong Yankee. He uh, aborted a leave attempt there. He looks to be reined in. Muscle memory protects rail position as the cat man moves him up on the outside. And he's sparring early with self-professed. A gap of two to Strong Yankee in the third position. Racino got away well in fourth. Northern Ensign is fifth to the opening quarter. The favorite, Classic Photo, is sixth. And in a surprise move, Vivid Photo is seventh near the back of the pack. But that one is followed by Muscle Bound getting down and dirty and after an early break Mr. Dream OM caught the field their single file the first quarter was pretty quick 27 seconds and down the back stretch they go and it's a cat fan who looks over his shoulder and uh, on the outside he sees Brian Sears with Strong Yankee making a backside brush to the front Strong Yankee will take over as they head towards the half mile now Muscle Memory back in the second spot self-professed is third Racino is fourth on the inside Northern Ensign is fifth that one followed by Classic Photo looking to track Northern Ensign who commits to the outside 
side. And that one will be followed by Vivid Photo. He is backed up now, third over, and uh, he'll have a long way to come. Then it's getting down and dirty. Muscle bound as excess cover. Two lengths to Mr. Dream O.N. The half was 55, so a breather of 28 seconds there for Strong Yankee. Strong Yankee looking pretty strong there on the far turn. Tough first over for Northern Ensign. Stride for stride with Muscle Memory. The Catman working out a perfect trip here so far. And on the outside, here comes a classic photo with Ron Pierce. He's tracked all the way by Vivid Photo. Roger Hammer is stalking Ron Pierce and fans to the outside full of trot. 124. They're in the stretch of the Hamiltonian. Strong Yankee, and they're looking to swarm in. Classic photo. Vivid photo on the outside. Out of the pocket. Muscle Memory three across the track in deep stretch. It's Vivid Photo. Muscle memory third, 152 and three. What an incredible performance. Everybody expected you to go for the lead, and you fooled them all, and you stayed off the pace, didn't you? Yes, this horse never showed racing off the pace, but he's a nice horse to drive. And I figured if I set off the pace and used him uh, towards the hand of the stretch, half to down stretch, he could outbrush any of them because he got a heck of a brush to it. He looks to be reined in. Muscle. And the perfect thing is that you got to follow classic photos. So you had the livest cover in the race, and when you tipped off, track announcer Ken Workington called you as having the most trot. What a plan. I mean, it, it couldn't have worked out any better. No, it worked out better than my plan last week. This one here worked out perfect for us. Let me ask you, did, did as we continue to watch the race, you are starting to move up with cover on the outside, and that is classic photos cover. You had to be feeling pretty good at that stage. Yes, I figured Ron, when he chipped three deep, I'd follow him, figured the halfway down the stretch, but my horse had a lot of trots set behind, so I just whipped him out four wide in and let him try. Did you know what kind of fractions they were going, 27, 55? I mean, that's that's definitely uh, good fractions. Uh, they came home in 57 and three, so the first half was quicker than the second. Coming from off the pace, that, that had to make you feel pretty good. Yes, I didn't know what the fractions were. I was just worried about where Ron was setting so I could follow Ron the whole way and make my move when he followed him and the head of stretch and just both always try to race home. Man. Let me ask you, now that it's over, now that you're the winner, you can give out your secret. Were you planning on doing this, coming from off the pace and just following Ron Pearson classic photo the whole time and yes. yet letting everybody think that you were going to be gunning out for the lead? Yes, because all my worst show was on top on top. No one knows he could just he could take off and come off the pace. Well, you sure showed a lot of versatility with Vivid Photo. Roger Hammer, congratulations on winning your first Hamiltonian and your first try. Thank you very much.